like the only parking spaces around here. There's a whole empty lot right there. Yeah, but, that's but oh, like that'd pizza. be too easy for him. That'd be for pizza. Oh my. What fuck. the fuck, Devin? I told you, isn't it being stupid? Well, yeah, because it's it's like I had to copy and paste it. Well, that's what I did, but it's like being hold stupid. On. I think I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know where I'm driving. I have a pull over. Oh, right McDonald's here. breakfast. Let's just get that. Do you? Well, we're here, and it is breakfast time. You can get breakfast all day, but you can only get like Certain bullshit things. things. Directions. I don't want fucking McDonald's breakfast, dude. Why? I'm not hungry. Every time I eat McDonald's breakfast, it gives me the shit. Thank you. But um. Have a nice day. You too. But he like he was trying to get his buddy to go, so they can drive up there. I was like, I'm leaving at like 9, and his buddy's like, I don't want to go. And then he's like, oh. And then he never said anything after that. I'm like, you can be a cameraman, you know, if you really want to. He's like, eh. I, I need to see that shit. Are we getting on the highway? It says turn right. Just yeah, come up here, and then get on the freeway. Left? Yeah. Durfee, that's the wrong way. You're on the wrong side of the road. I'm never gonna be able to find it. Continue on US 127 North. I know! Devin. Ah! Devin. <laughs> Jesus. Except for I don't like chicken. You fucking, you make a fucking mess in here, I'll stab you in the throat. Die by the O'Reilly's, die by the O'Reilly's. Well, it's like, 
that's the mentality that people have when they rob places, I think. Yeah. But it's just, like, it's not worth it. Because you're always going to get caught. Maybe back in, like, the fucking, I don't know, like, the 70s. When there wasn't a whole lot of, like, maybe even the 60s when there wasn't a whole lot of technology shit. What was the name of that exit? Uh, it'll tell us. It's 189. Oh. You got five miles. But, yeah, it's, like, I feel like back in the day, that's why people would rob places. But nowadays, you're just an idiot. Like, there's so many, that there's social media, there's everything. Like, yeah. people just get caught stupid. Well, now there's fucking cameras, alarm systems. I just, why, you know, why? You're gonna, like, if you're in that bad of a jam, like, you're not gonna get a lot of money. I mean, have you ever been in a position where, like, a, Hypothetically speaking, I feel like the most you could get out of a place like that would maybe be like 500 bucks. Like out of a gas station. Probably about like, right. You know what I mean? Like the max you could get. Have you ever been in a jam so bad that you risk going to jail over $500? If someone gave me the opportunity to risk my life, like... That's Because like, that's the other thing. You gotta, you're risking your life, too. Yeah. Because, like, you know that there's a slim chance that there's a person who has, like, a gun on him. Yeah. Like CPM, and who knows how to fucking get fucking out of it. And just cracks him off in the kneecap and is, like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't know. Like, the, the, I just don't get it. It's like, if you're in that bad of a jam, then... What I don't get, I just think about this up. until now. Okay, say you're going to... Let's just fucking say O'Reilly's, right? Say somebody comes in with a gun trying to steal the money in the register, yeah. right? Like you said, at max, you know, the store may have five 500 in the register yeah, at, yeah, like, max. Because, yeah. like, if someone came in there with a $100 bill and they yeah, could, like, change for stuff, I mean, you got to have, like, 50s and stuff in there anyway. I mean, yeah. I, I could see that. Yeah, 500 sounds like the max. I don't know, man. That's just, just, that's just a spitball, but, like, yeah. in the dark. Say they came in with a gun to steal the money. Okay, they needed, say they really needed that $500, right? Just really bad, whatever it was. Yeah. Why didn't they just sell the gun that they just robbed the store <laughs> with? Well, you gotta think too, most people who rob a store, it's not with a really expensive gun. Yeah, true. Like, how much is a Glock? Yeah, mine was like five, something, five. It was between five and six. Actually, it was a, barely over 600 after tax. Well, see, and I also feel like someone who has a gun like that it probably either borrows it or they've had it for a really long time. Yeah. The other thing you gotta think, if you're a criminal who does it, you probably got your gun illegally. Yeah. You know what I mean? The other thing I was thinking... Which is gonna cost more, actually. Yeah. That makes it... I don't know. It's, 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 See, it's it just stupid. Made, it makes no sense. It's stupid. Why would you rob a place? It's just so... It's so dumb. <laughs> like, okay, how about this? This was happening in Mount Pleasant for a while ago. I remember my school actually, for Snow Road. I remember my school actually did like a play thing on this. It was really funny, but it was bad at the same time. There was a guy who was robbing like multiple places at once in Mount Pleasant. Oh, that would that. be the way to do it if you're gonna do it. Yeah. But then again, it's like, yeah, you get more money. And five hundred's best case scenario, like a store. Yeah. Like I had a gas Dude, station. I you know love it. At the dealership, the Chevy dealership in town, you remember when those people jacked all the rims of tires? I don't know, yeah, that was... Oh my was, god, they got, I don't know how the fuck they did it, I just remember like hearing about it. They got so many fucking rims of tires off of brand new vehicles. Like, they had to have like had a system and had it like just fucking down. I don't think they ever caught them. Isn't that ridiculous? Yeah, but it's just like... <sighs> Snowball Road? Yeah. Snowball Road. So wait, what was I just saying though? I, I was that coming play, that play or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like, oh, by the way, that was some bullshit. My school used a prop airsoft gun in in the play, and then I tried using a video that had a prop gun in it. And they're like, no. You know where I got all the prop guns for the videos? Where? From the fucking school's play. <laughs> like seriously, yeah. a bunch of kids were. Yeah, you want to turn off here? Just, just, just a bunch of the kids were in drama. And they knew where all the prop guns. Anyhow, so yeah. God, your phone feels like I'm fucking playing. I don't know. But here's the thing. If you went through and you robbed multiple places, you'd get more money, but yeah. you'd have more evidence on you. I'll tell you when you get there. I don't fucking got it. But yeah, you'll, you'll have more evidence on where you are. Yeah. 
Yeah, so it's just like, you're still fucked. Like, <laughs> I don't get it. The only way to do it is if you have a fucking, if you, if you pulled up to a place in, a in an mile, airplane right to, yeah, to fucking Mexico, <laughs> you're just like, give me the $200 you got. Go well, here in Michigan, left. how fucking long would it take you to get to fucking Mexico? I'm just saying, or Canada, I don't know. Oh, I I'm guess you saying, could fly to Canada. The, well, you'd still get fogged. Turn right onto Snowball Road, then turn left onto old US Highway 27. My point is, it's it's dumb. Yeah. The amount of like shit Effort. you have to go through for the amount that you got out of it is just is not worth it. The people who rob places are stupid. What the fuck? This is a weird ass oh. road, dude. Turn left onto old US Highway 27. Oh, I like that GMC. It's a clean GMC. How much I want for that fucker? Uh, probably too much. Let's pick it better. up and just drive it back right now. Yeah, right. It was a start to me up set. I feel like I've been down this road before. Yeah, but it's like, okay, this camera, camera, you can't Continue see this. Continue on old US Highway 27 for a half mile. All right, but there's the a freeway right there, and then there's just a dirt road. It's, that's so weird. Why is there just instant?
Dad's going home with what? us, buddy. What? I think it's such a piece. Dude, you know what? No joke. Have you ever heard of, like, I think it's a Dodge? I can't remember if it's a Dodge or a Plymouth. <laughs> Have you ever heard Turn of a Dodge? Turn left South Reserve Road. Yeah, I think I have. They're cool, man. They're like, I think they're two liter. They're two door. They look cool, and they're like turbo. Cross traffic does not. If not, matter. I can be like, hey, where's the gun show? They'll know. Yeah, but don't ask like some guy about it's a jackass. Where's the gun show? Here's the gun show. It's like, all right. Oh, like the guy in the hot <laughs> the dealership. Hey, how'd you guys get those bikes up there? Oh, I just you know lift them. Like, oh my god, this guy's such. Wait, what did you say that? The guy at fucking uh, the Honda shop, remember? Was I with you? Yeah, you were. Was I really? <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, wait, no, that was Hannah. Never mind. Hey, is there any fucking bike shops around here? I don't know. We I'll, can check. I'll take a look at a few bikes if they're around here. Why'd you turn that off? Wrong parking lot. <laughs> hey, we're leaving now. Siri, I'm drunk. <laughs> I can't be your designated driver. You'd better find someone else. Call um, me a taxi. Oh, that's cool. See? Durfee bought a gun. Really big gun. I bought corn nuts. Yeah, really corn nice nuts. corn nuts. I should have bought that extended now. I should have bought the extended corn nuts. Oh, God. Oh, God. Are we going left? Take it off these corn nuts, son. <laughs> Come on. I'm good on the corn nuts. No, let Come me on. drive. Come Get on. the corn Come on. No, 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 no. Are you holding on? Yeah. You don't want to hit out these these sweet corn nuts, dude? For anybody... Turn left onto South Reserve Road. Right here? Left right here? West on Michigan. Left right here? Turn left, too late. Turn left onto South Reserve Road. Fuck off! West Houghton Lake Drive towards Shot Street. Then turn left onto South Reserve Road. Turn left onto South Jesus! Road. I heard you the first time, GPS. <laughs> Fuck. We're, we're not, like a, we're not stuff. under a light or anything, are we? Yeah, we are. Shit, do you even... Oh. It's green. I'm just good. waiting for traffic. You are traffic. on the fastest route. You will arrive at 12.53 p.m. Good. Continue on South Reserve Road for one and a half miles. So, yeah. Anyone who hasn't had corn nuts, go out and buy yourself some corn nuts. There's property for that. I got some corn nuts for sale. Do you want some? Give your mom these nuts. I'd give your mom these corn nuts. She'd like them better. You want some corn nuts? No! Come on, man! Will you shut the hell up about the corn nuts? Just a little bit. A little bit. Take a hit. Take it on. Okay, 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 okay. The sign said man candy. Those are man nuts. <laughs> I thought it was weird it said man candy. I was like, what the fuck? In a quarter mile, turn right onto Emory Road. No. You have like Mike and Ike or Jelly Bean looking things. Yeah. We're like, what the fuck are those made out of? Like, Some take a strawberry and I smash it real hard in my hand until it turns into one of these gooey candies. He just, oh, and then bam. It's so Aaron manly. Did. Look at that. I know. I'm not a big fan of the big rims, but I do like that dark. 
Ooh, another motorcycle. Ah, what are you doing in the middle of the road? Get back all my vehicles up, man. <laughs> Look at my truck and my boat. And yeah. Yeah, but it's really convenient when you back up your shit. I never do it, but when I do, it's so nice because you just like, just get out of your driveway. <sighs> oh yeah, like I was saying earlier about the Buick, um, the manifold's pretty cracked, so passenger side especially, it leaks exhaust like a motherfucker. You know what else is cracked? So you just have to like roll down the windows, and it's okay. Like I drove an hour with that car to some place with like a bunch of people. It wasn't bad. That's what great. Jake's like, let's go on a road trip. One can take his car, you can take your Camaro, I'll take my new Chrysler, and I'm like... I would do that. I wouldn't go to, like, a different state, but I would do it. I just had to be careful. That's what I'm like. I don't know. Like, <coughs> it's different when you're in a new vehicle, but when you got something old, it's kinda, it gets sketchy after a while. Yeah. The Buick is a little sketchy. I think I'm going to just start redoing all the electrical. Doesn't that look like Hot Rod Magazine? A little bit. Corn nuts. Dude, corn nuts. Dude, corn nuts. What the fuck is the name of that road? Corn nuts. <laughs> you keep saying the word of God, quick. Turn left onto all US Highway 27. Deadstream Road. The one that we just passed? Yeah. He's looking, he's got a left, uh, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> left blinker on, but you're pulling right? Yeah, that's pretty weird. What are you, an idiot? It's an old person, they're driving an equal. I can see his wife's old person hair. Old person hair, boy? Yeah, dude. Old, old person, person hair. I'm surprised you don't have old it's hair. It's like curly and stuff. Your cataracts and your Continue on old US <laughs> Highway 27, so sure. and a half mile. I don't have anything fast. Well, my Cadillac's fast. I like to think it's a fast car. I mean, it's not a slow car. Oh, oh, oh. hell no, man. Quarter mile, nice. turn right onto Snowball Road. Snowball. Snowball. Why did you think it was Snowball? I don't know. It was the way I read it. <laughs> I don't know. This is weird. Why would anybody have a road that Turn right onto Snowball, Snowball Road. That's a perfect episode idea, though. What? Getting two of my go karts to fire up. Yeah. <clears throat> That's how we're gonna get sick of just Fairmont videos as long as everybody else. I know. In moderation, though. In moderation. Well, we only do it. Turn left onto the US 127 South Ramp to Claire. I just want to have like one fucking successful video with the Fairmont where we like actually drive it somewhere. Yeah. You know what I mean? I feel like then we could start doing other shit, but right now it's just like. Yeah. yeah, we've worked on it, but how many videos have we Turn actually seen it run? US 127 South the second episode was just us towing it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Family restaurant. What's up with that Jeep? I don't know. Fuck. It's just kind of chilling there. Okay, somebody Whoa. just hit a gnarly ass burnout. Damn, son. Someone was getting it. That's pretty long. Dude, have you tried any of the like different flavors they have in corn nuts? They got like ranch, they got like barbecue. I normally don't, don't eat corn nuts, Chris. You don't eat corn nuts? Not really. They're fucking delicious, dude. I remember my dad showed me corn nuts for the first time. I was like, that's really weird because it just looks like corn. And my dad's like, yeah, it does. Take a bite. And it just, it tastes like, like compact Fritos. It's so good. But they have like so many different flavors. They got like cheese flavor, I think. I don't know. I know they got ranch. It's just like, oh, so good, dude. Corn nuts. But that guy, when he sold me those corn nuts, he was like, these corn nuts here, they're not going to break your teeth. Which is so true, because when you're eating some corn nuts, and they're like, you know, just regular old school corn nuts, like from gas station, some of those fuckers are hard. I don't, I don't know what they do to their corn, because their corn's like way bigger. Like those corn nuts, like they were the right size of corn. But like, if you go and get corn nuts at a gas station, they're like fucking huge. I don't know. They're still really good. Well, they're huge compared to that. <laughs> what? A You're just talking about corn. 
Because they're good. <laughs> Which, you know what, leads me to think, how do they cook corn nuts? Is it, it's like solid, but corn isn't solid. It's like full of juice. Oh my god. Well, isn't corn full of juice? <laughs> corn is very juicy, they're right? They're not made out of corn, they're made out of nuts. No, they're made out of corn, but they're fried like nuts. That's why they call them corn nuts, because they're corn. But they're like, <laughs> they're like nuts. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you just need to shut up. What, what dude? I love corn nuts. They're good. We need a calendar for how many times you say corn nuts. Dude, I'm telling you, they're good. You know what's weird is I was watching Mighty Car Mods, and right at the end they started eating corn nuts. And they were talking about them too. Like It sounded like they were like making an advertisement for corn nuts, which was a little weird. Like right now it sounds like I'm making an advertisement for corn nuts, but I'm not. They're fucking good. That's great. They're good, dude. But yeah, like how do you make them? Well, you gotta think, cause it, like corn's just full of like juice. <laughs> like, I'm counting that as four. Well, it's like it's not like popcorn, like popcorn kernels, like it's actual corn. It's not like I count that as five. But it's <laughs> David, I'm being serious. Like, okay. like it's not a kernel, but it's not like I don't know. It's it's like it looks like corn. Hey, are you supposed con. to open or uh, upload a video one day? Yeah. It's Monday? That's why I need music, dude. It's kind of hard. It's no doubt. Then you need to do it tonight. I gotta wake up in the morning. Do it tomorrow. I might be able to. I'll just make the episode on Monday. I've done that before. <sighs> How many people out there like to score no odds? 17,500 miles. Oh, no, they're gonna say 17,000. Exactly. I think we should get off the topic of corn nuts. But dude, it's like also Fritos, right? You know, like like this is supposed to be refried beans, but they taste it. It's like the weirdest sauce and dip chips. In. This beans. So you can go buy salsa, you can go buy cheese, but seriously, you can go buy like a can of weird like smashed up beans. It's not like regular beans; it's like pasty. Maybe like, like regular like. Refried Why beans. are we talking about food? What? Because of the, it's something to talk about. Why are you talking about food? You realize the whole way there you were talking about McDonald's. Now the whole the way whole back way. you're talking about. No, we're about talking about robberies. Okay. Fine. Now we're talking about corn nuts and like Fritos and shit. Let's talk about something more interesting. Like what are Cheetos nuts. made out of? Because no, like Cheetos. Like you take off the powder. What is that? And fucking packing peanuts. It's like packing peanuts in a microwave. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I it's like know. styrofoam food. What the fuck is a cheetah made out of? They're so good, too. It's just the powder. Like, alright. Have you ever had, like... <laughs> just, just, can we get off the subject <laughs> of packing food? No, no, no. Because I, I have a good question for you. And I know you've thought about this. Have you ever had, like, a sauce or something that's so good that you want an excuse to eat it? No. Like... Like, okay, I go to I go to Burger King, right? And you get onion rings, right? It's like the only fast food place that just has onion rings. Okay. Their onion rings are, like, weird. They're not the best onion Have rings. Have you ate one of their hot dogs? No, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm, I'm fucking scared. Why would you get a hot dog? Like, all right, hot dogs are usually already shady. Then you buy one from, like, wh where did that thing come from, dude? You can't tell, you can't, all right. You grind up a cow, that's some hamburger. Like, everyone's got hamburger. Where the fuck do you get a hot dog? <laughs> like, it's all the leftovers. It's yeah, but it's like Is it the leftovers of fucking Burger King? It's like they just did they're like these patties are a week old, let's match these bastards up into a hot dog. It's like the McRib dude. The fuck? That shit ain't rib. It's like some plaster shit they threw in a bowl and then covered in barbecue stuff. Ask for one of those fuckers without barbecue sauce. You don't want it. Because it's like, what the fuck is this? God. Back to my back to my question here, though. Like, Burger King, right? They got zesty sauce. We had zesty sauce? No, actually. 
You haven't had zesty sauce? No. We need to stop at Burger King. Alright, dude. But anyway, they have the zesty sauce. That shit's the bomb. Alright. Not only do I dip fries or fucking onion rings in it, I dip a motherfucking sandwich in that shit, dude. Chicken, beef, doesn't matter. I'll just fucking pour that shit on my sandwich. But it's like, have you ever had a sauce that was so good that you just want an excuse to eat it? Perfect really example, yum yum sauce. I don't like that either. You don't like that? No. Are you kidding me? No. Dude, what the fuck's wrong with you? That stuff's the same way. I want a fucking excuse to eat that shit. Because you can't just dip your hand in a fucking jar of honey and shit. Like, honey the poo, dude. You can't just take a fucking bowl of fucking honey mustard and just blah, 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 you know what I mean? You gotta like have chicken nuggets or sandwich or some shit to eat them. Or fries. <clears throat> like, have you ever just been in the mood for ketchup? Like, <laughs> like you just want to eat something with ketchup on it? You never had a burger and you're like, you I don't even this like ketchup. ketchup. Do you fucking like anything, dude? Not really. What the fuck? You know what you like? Ribs, fucking hot dogs from Burger King. That's the shit you would like. That's some off the wall shit. I couldn't remember if my hat was forward or backwards. Does it doesn't matter. Yeah. Because when I lean back, oh, it fits backwards and like, it <laughs> like cuts off blood to my fucking brain all spine. And I'm like, oh. Uh, here's the weird on her. You ever sleep and be like sleeping in the same spot? You know how your arm goes now? Yeah. You ever like slept long on your neck or something and like part of your head is numb? You know what? Isn't that the weirdest feeling ever? My parents' couch is like that. Like it doesn't have enough cush. Like, yeah. You know the armrest? Yeah. You try to lay down and then it like cuts off. The, like I remember Joel was over one time and he said he was like sleeping on the couch without a pillow all like all night. And he said he woke up and his head was asleep and he <laughs> fucking freaked him out and I was like that's weird whatever. And then it happened to me, and I was like, what the fuck? It was weird. It's really strange. Yeah. It was weird. Dude, you know what? Like, sometimes, like, when I don't have a blanket and I try to sleep, I, like, lay down on my stomach, right? And then I, like, cross my arms like this, so it's warm. Well, one time I, like, crossed my arms, and I woke up, and both my arms were asleep. <laughs> but they were, like, so asleep that I couldn't move them. So, like, I didn't know what to do, and I had to, like... <laughs> I had to, like, try to, like, roll over until, like, fucking blood went back in my arms. It was weird. I could say, like, oh, shit, I trapped myself. Yeah, because you're, like, laying on your face pretty much. And, like, I bet people have died like that. They just, like, suffocate to death because their arms fell asleep. But then again, it's like, you didn't try how to live. So, like, I don't know. How much further we got on this fucking road? Mm, 21 miles. What's your favorite sauce, though? Barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce. Really what, do you, what do you eat barbecue sauce with? Don't yeah, just be a smart ass and say fucking barbecue with some bunch of everything. Everything. Chicken. Everything. Certain steak. Everything. Uh, chicken nuggets. What's something weird that you like eat barbecue sauce with? Like, do you dip fries in barbecue sauce? I'm not talking like putting it on fucking ice cream. Uh, you don't dip fries in barbecue sauce. Right. Would you? That's the shit I'm talking about. Why, why would you eat that with fries? It's, that doesn't really go good with it, you know? Why, why not some ketchup? But, like, you eat, like you dip, you dip fries in barbecue sauce. Like, it was just the right barbecue sauce. I'm not talking, like, hate one or something. But it's like, you just want that sauce. But it's like, you don't want... You're just making me hungry for a like fucking steak now. Actually, over at my house, I got, like, rib parts. But we'd have to cook them up and stuff. Man. <laughs> Look at that van! Look at that van! 